Melinda Messenger, 51, has taken to social media to share her thoughts on the new Netflix documentary by Meghan Markle, 41, and Prince Harry, 38, which sees them make a series of explosive claims about the royal family. The former model gushed over the couple in view of her 24,100 followers, as she wished them happiness, peace and success. She tweeted, Hashtag Meghan and Harry Netflix bright, honest, brave and compassionate and unwilling to be manipulated. I wish them happiness, peace and success, Melissa added alongside a purple love heart. Sick, other social media users agreed with the television presenter, who was hailed for her lovely response to the docuseries. Sarah Yoga 81 said, what a lovely positive response. How might the world or at least UK feel if all responses to this saga were so full of light and love? Thank you Melinda for showing everyone a brighter way. Sick, Jonathan Shaw 74 added, some people don't like seeing others happy and successful, also they're easily manipulated to follow whichever spin the media wants to put on it. It's sad. Sick, loose women star Denise Welch simply stated, Me too 20. But Denise was not the only loose women panelist to voice their favorable opinion on the couple after watching the series. Fern Britton revealed yesterday that her view on the couple has softened as she lashed out at the media coverage about them. In a candid Twitter post, the former This Morning host accused newspapers of running a campaign of negativity. She wrote, I may be a voice in the wilderness here, but my view on the hashtag Sussexes has softened. The newspapers did run a campaign of negativity with added lies. The hashtag whales are stuck in a world of strange rules and furious to be left without hashtag H and M support. Hashtag the king not knowing how to fix it, the broadcaster concluded. Sick, during the fourth episode of their Netflix series, Harry and Meghan looked back on their first home in the UK, describing it as a chapter in our lives where I don't think anyone could believe what it was actually like behind the scenes. Harry said, as far as people were concerned, we were living in a palace. And we were. In a cottage. Together, with Meghan, he added, we were living on palace grounds. The Duchess continued, Kensington Palace sounds very regal. Of course it does. It says palace in the name, but Nottingham Cottage was so small. The whole thing's on a slight lean, Harry added. Really low ceilings, I don't know who was there before. They must have been short. Meghan recalled, he would hit his head constantly in that place because he's so tall, 